Mars for Newbies, a fun guide to the red planet. Hey there, space explorers. Ready to dive into the coolest guide to Mars you've ever read? You're in the right place. Our first chapter, Mars for Newbies, a fun guide to the red planet, is all about turning you into a Mars pro. 1. The Big Red What? Ever looked up at the night sky and spotted that reddish dot? That's Mars, our next-door neighbor in the vast universe. It's not just any old planet, it's a world of mysteries, adventures, and possibly the future vacation spot for humans. But before you pack your space suit and freeze-dried ice cream, let's get the lowdown on this fascinating planet. 2. Your space homestead awaits. Imagine having a Martian address. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? Well, it could be a reality sooner than we think. This guide is like your personal GPS to understanding Mars from the inside out. We're talking about everything from those giant dust storms, which are totally Instagram-worthy, by the way, to the big question, can we actually live there? 3. Space Myths Busted did you know some people think Mars is full of little green aliens or that it's just a red desert with nothing fun? We're here to bust those myths and show you the real deal about the red planet. Spoiler alert, it's way cooler than just a bunch of rocks and dust. 4. Mars, the ultimate adventure playground asterisk asterisk. Imagine playing hide-and-seek in Martian caves or having a low-gravity soccer match. Mars might just be the ultimate adventure playground for future generations. We're going to explore all the fun and wild possibilities that make Mars an exciting place for future explorers like you. So, buckle up, space buddies. We're about to embark on a wild ride through the universe to our potential second home. Mars, here we come. The chapter titled, Mars, Landscapes of Poison and Toxic Skies, but what an opportunity, provides a detailed and engaging exploration of the challenges and possibilities of colonizing Mars. This chapter delves into the harsh and hostile environment of Mars, characterized by its toxic soil and a thin atmosphere that is largely composed of carbon dioxide, making it unsuitable for direct human habitation. Key points in this chapter include... 1. Harsh Martian Environment The authors describe Mars's landscape, marked by its red soil rich in iron oxide, which gives the planet its characteristic color. They detail the toxic elements found in Martian soil, like perchlorates, which pose significant challenges for agriculture and human health. 2. Atmospheric Challenges Mars's atmosphere is discussed particularly its inability to support human life and its thinness, which contributes to extreme temperature variations. The authors explore the implications of these conditions for human survival and the necessity of protective habitats. 3. Terraforming Prospects Despite the inhospitable conditions, the chapter considers the potential for terraforming Mars to make it more Earth-like. This includes discussions on possibly warming the planet and altering its atmosphere to support human life, though the authors acknowledge the immense technological and ethical challenges this presents. 4. Technological Innovations The chapter examines the various technologies and strategies that could be employed to make living on Mars feasible. This includes building sealed habitats, recycling resources, and producing food and oxygen in a closed environment. 5. Scientific and Exploratory Opportunities Emphasizing the opportunities Mars presents, the chapter discusses the scientific value of exploring the red planet. This includes studying its geology, climate, and potential for past or present life, which could offer insights into the broader questions of life in the universe. 6. Human Adaptation and Psychological Considerations The authors touch upon how humans might adapt to life on Mars, including physiological and psychological challenges. 
They discuss the need for robust mental health support systems for inhabitants facing isolation and the unique stresses of Martian life. In summary, this chapter presents a balanced view of Mars as a potential site for human colonization. It lays out the severe challenges posed by the planet's environment, while also highlighting the technological and scientific opportunities that such an endeavor could bring. The authors blend scientific facts with engaging narrative, making complex concepts accessible and intriguing for the reader. The discussion of terraforming prospects involves the exploration of the potential to modify Mars' environment to make it more Earth-like, thereby supporting human life. Terraforming is a hypothetical process that entails a massive, planet-wide engineering project to change a planet's conditions to resemble those of Earth. The following points are key to understanding the terraforming prospects of Mars. 1. Warming Mars one of the primary goals of terraforming Mars would be to warm the planet, as its current average surface temperature is much lower than Earth's. This could potentially be achieved by creating a greenhouse effect, similar to what is observed on Earth. The idea is to release gases like carbon dioxide, which are trapped in the Martian soil and polar ice caps, into the atmosphere to thicken it and retain more solar heat. 2. Creating a breathable atmosphere To support human life, Mars would need an atmosphere rich in oxygen. Currently, Mars' atmosphere is thin and composed mostly of carbon dioxide. The process of terraforming would involve finding ways to convert this carbon dioxide into oxygen, possibly through introducing photosynthetic organisms like cyanobacteria or engineering large-scale chemical processing plants. 3. Water Resources For terraforming to be successful, liquid water is essential. Mars has water ice, particularly at its poles and beneath its surface, which could potentially be melted to form liquid water bodies. This melting could be a natural consequence of the planet warming. 4. Protecting against radiation Mars lacks a magnetic field to protect it from solar and cosmic radiation. An essential part of terraforming Mars would be to devise ways to shield the planet from this radiation, possibly through creating an artificial magnetic field or thickening the atmosphere to act as a barrier. 5. Ethical and Technological Challenges The concept of terraforming Mars presents significant ethical and technological challenges. The ethical considerations include the potential impact on any existing Martian ecosystems and the broader philosophical implications of altering a planet. Technologically, the process would require advances far beyond current capabilities and an enormous investment of resources and time. 6. Feasibility and Long-Term Outlook while terraforming Mars is a fascinating idea, it remains in the realm of science fiction with current technology. The timescale for such a project would likely span centuries, and the feasibility depends heavily on future technological developments and the willingness of human society to undertake such a monumental task. In summary, terraforming Mars presents a vision of transforming the red planet into a habitable world for humans. However, it remains a theoretical and highly complex endeavor, with many scientific, ethical, and practical challenges yet to be addressed.